Hello again, boys and girls. This is this is a couple of times we're meeting today, isn't it? So I told you you're going to have two different ways to make a puppy craft. So the second option that you'd like to maybe consider doing for the puppy craft requires a couple of things. First thing you need is a paper plate. The next thing you're going to need is two cotton balls. Then you're going to need some craft glue. You're going to need two brown construction paper cut out puppy ears. Any shape you'd like to make, just any fun time kind of a puppy ear. You're going to need those quarter size eyes made out of white paper. Then you're going to need those two dime size, let me find the other one, dime size little pupils for the eyes. Tiny little black circle. You're going to need two brown sticks, about uh, two inches long, and one pink or red tongue. It's a straight edge with a little curve. Okay, boys and girls. Now, once you've had all your supplies on your table or your workspace, we're going to do the assembly. So take your paper plate, take your two ears, and glue them on. So that it looks like this. Okay. Then you're going to take your two quarter size eyes and glue them on your plate. Two dabs of glue. One, two. There are your two. Now we're going to get our two dime sized pupils. We're going to stick them inside another little dab. As Mrs. Everhart says in the classroom at Small World, and I can say it here too, a little dab will do ya. And you can make wacky eyes. You can put your little pupils anywhere you want inside your little white eyeball. Now we're going to put some we're going to take our little brown sticks and we're going to make some eyebrows. So it all depends on how you want to put your eyebrows, whether it's a happy puppy, a mad puppy, an excited puppy. Mine's going to be excited puppy. Whee! Hey. Okay, we have two more things. So now we're going to take our cotton balls and we're going to put a little, two little dabs of glue so that our cotton balls stick side by side right next to each other to be the little fluffy news. Look at that. Do you see that? And then we're going to take a little shot of glue here. We're going to put on our tongue. So there's our puppy. And what you can do, just for a little fun, is to bend one of your puppy ears down. Look, sometimes the puppy's ears go down. I hope you have fun making this craft with your family. And remember, if you either make the paper plate craft or you make the crayon colored pencil puppy craft, Please take a picture and send it to me and Mrs. Redding. We are so excited to see what you're doing at home, and we'd love to get some emails from you. Have a great day. See you soon. Bye. Roof.